Hey everyone, Sponge Murphy here with another eBay loot video. It's been probably a good month since I've done the last video. Um, I haven't got a whole lot done, but I have been keeping my eye on eBay, trying to get some cheap deals, you know, wheeling and dealing a little bit. So, um, yeah, so I got a couple of things over, I'd say over the last month, couple of weeks. Um, and I think that might be it for a while. I have my eye on a few things. But uh, for now, I said I think it's time to show what I've got. So um, I'll just move these aside. I kind of got a, a good mixture of um, some stuff that I've never bought before that I never had any intention to buy them. Um, but first up, I got the old Lizard Man Army book. Um, this is this is not eight edition. This is I think probably six to seventh edition book. Um, Again, like I bought the Empire book when Age of Sigmar came out. These are redundant now unless you want to play all editions. But uh, it's a great source book. It's a great, there's like really nice pictures in it. Uh, most of the models in this are still out now. Um, I know that Krogar model, that's not out anymore. But the other one is pretty similar. Uh, Colon Cavalry, I still have a box of them to go through. The Terradon Riders, there's a new box of them. Um, but there's a lot of you know interesting, interesting bits to reading it. The fluff is there, even though their fluff is completely different now in Age of Sigmar. But um, you know it's a great little read, something to keep you busy if you're interested in it and everything. Um, and just like the Empire book, it's a great resource book to go through as well. So uh, I picked that up for a euro, which was nothing. Um, I got a bit robbed with delivery. Delivery was five euro, and when it came. The uh, the postage stamp had written on two thirty, um. So if you take the price of maybe the envelope it was in, you know, three euro is what it should have been really. But anyway, got it for a euro. It's a good deal. Interesting read. Uh, next up I got were these. I have to zoom in a bit. There we go. I think that's a much better view. Is it lower the camera down a good bit? Um, this is something that I've never bought before. Um, and to be honest with you, I had like zero interest until recently. I've got a couple of projects uh, to do for next year. Um, you know, putting some of my models on display for certain things. So I think this is a perfect time to get some Lord of the Rings models. If you walk, like, if you want people to, if you want to catch people's eye, for I have to, maybe I should have explained it better. But like, some of my models will be on display for something that's planned in the future. Um, not everybody knows what Warhammer is, whether it's Fantasy, Age of Sigmar or 40k, but nearly everybody knows what Lord of the Rings is. So I got these as part of, uh, they're going to catch someone's eye. They'll see the model, say yeah they're cool, and then they'll see the Lord of the Rings model. So that's why I'm trying to get some of these for now. What the plan was to try and get the Fellowship and maybe some bad guys if I can, just to go with it. So um, first up I got... All the, I was gonna say all the Frodo's. I got all the hobbits. That's it. I couldn't think of it. Um, I got these in a pretty, pretty decent deal. I think they were five euro, just under five euro. They were four something for the four of them. Uh, postage was pretty cheap. They're from an Irish seller, so you know the postage was pretty good. Um, the only thing with the Lord of the Rings models is they are really, really small. It's a bit bright here so the detail mightn't be as good. Um, they are the all metal models and the good thing about them is you get the names on the bottom of them so I can tell that's Merry. Merry and Pippin are the ones that I always get confused. I'm sure a lot of people do. Um, this one, Sam. Yeah. So they're Samwise Ganji I think he's pronounced. I'm not madly familiar with Lord of the Rings, I've just seen the movies. Uh, I've never read the books. That's Frodo. Oh no, that's Pippin. Um, you know they're really nice. They're really small. And um, if you if you think dwarves are small in fantasy, jeez, these are really a lot smaller again. And there you have Frodo then, the main guy, which he's probably my favorite out of the the hobbits. Really nice little model there. Um, yeah, so I got the four them for. Uh, it was just under a fiver, it was four something, I can't remember, I just looked at it this morning, I just seen four something. So, really good deal, four of them came together. 
Uh, next I got was Legolas. Or Legolas. Uh, got, got him at a steal, got him for 99 cent. Uh, after saying all the that these Lord of the Rings models are all after saying guy on eBay, so delivery was very cheap and very quick as well. Uh, he's one of my favorites from Lord of the Rings. He's pretty cool. It's a really nice looking model. Uh, yeah, and then I think he this guy is pretty hard to get. It's Gimli, and when I say hard, is there's a lot of Lord of the Rings miniatures on eBay. And this guy you don't see as much. Um, I struggle to get Aragon because the price for Aragon goes up a lot near the end of the bid. But there was only like two models of Gimli I could find or three. There's three auctions, not three models, just three auctions in general. So I picked him up for I think it was about two fifty, two euro. Um so I was happy with that. I didn't mind paying that um because you know, I have them, but I don't have to worry about getting them. All I'm missing is Gandalf, which I nearly had. He gets pretty pricey as well. Um, I'm looking for... What's the other guy? I mentioned him earlier. I can't remember. Aragon, that's it. Um, and Boromir, which... Yeah, I can get him. He gets a bit pricey, but he's pretty handy. So, um, yeah, so I think all together... Uh, these have five, six, seven. These all these are just under ten or so nine something, and um, you know excluding postage and packaging, which I think I got a pretty good deal on. Um, and for now I'm just keeping an eye out on more Lord of the Rings stuff on eBay. I want to try and get, you know, a, a couple of bad guys. Or I had my eye on the Lurts model, but he gets a bit pricey near the end. And obviously I want to try and get Gandalf as well. Gandalf is one of the important ones. Him and Aragorn. Or Aragorn. Aragorn. I don't know. Whatever it is. Anyway. Thanks for watching. I uh, hope you've enjoyed this eBay loot. So hopefully I can get back into the swing of things now. With more videos. I haven't done much now in the last month or two. But uh, thanks for watching. Let me know in the comment section below if you think I got some good deals on this. Let me know what you think of the Lord of the Rings models. Uh, Lizard Man book. Hit the like button and thanks for watching. See you guys next video.